called The Chase and uh, written by Dexter Gordon. Thanks. We're going to continue with uh, something by Randy Weston right now entitled Berkshire Blues. Yeah, thank you all for coming out tonight. It's like I can... I know you're out there.
Yeah, that's Hank Himsoth on the piano. Oh, man. Yeah. I, we got lucky tonight. <laughs> Aaron Easley on the drums. Yeah. We're lucky to have a couple of doctors in the house. Dr. James Suter on the bass. And we're lucky to have Bruce Saunders on the guitar tonight. Man, what a band. My colleague, John Mills, Dr. John Mills. We're going to continue with a composition of a, uh, my worthy constituent, Rich Harney. This is one he wrote entitled Soul Revival. I should mention, oh. I should mention that's Alex Koch. In case you didn't happen to know that already, that's Alex Koch, yeah.
stick with the ones you were doing together? We did. Are we running out of time already? We did. I like that tune, though. I want to hear it. <laughs> what do you think? What? We oh, are going to do some features. <laughs> and we we're going to feature. We're going to do, we're do fours? Yeah, we're going to do fours. Yeah, yeah. 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 Don't panic. Alex will be back. In fact, at some point here, he's going to do a, a tune that's just going to feature him, and I'm, uh, I'm taking the honors first. This is a song that I uh, play with various groups that I've uh, participated in around town. It was pretty much any time you compose something, there's some kind of direct inspiration musically. And in the case of this song, it was the great Brazilian composer, singer, songwriter, Milton Nascimento. Who, and this one afternoon, this was sort of my impression or my uh, channeling of Milton. I don't know if how long it sounds like that, but uh, that's kind of where it comes from. This is called Force of Nature.
Dr. John Mills. We're going to continue with a composition by uh, Chicago tenor player Clifford Jordan. This is entitled Through the Years.
that was uh, through the years. Man, we, through a lot of years. We, we have. We were talking about it. Uh, hey. three guys. Whoa. James <laughs> is catching up. Oh, Aaron is catching up. Slowly. Bruce, we're catching up with Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> John and I have played for many, many years. Anyway, we're going to continue with a piece uh, of uh, our good colleague, Rich Harney, entitled Pillows.
We're going to give John a little break for a moment, and uh, we're going to continue. I fell in love with this tune a while back. It's called Close Enough for Love by Johnny Mandel and Paul Williams.
I think that was close enough for love. <laughs> I'm not taking that. <laughs> Good thing these mics aren't loud. Okay. <coughs> Thank you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, this is Alex Koch on the tenor sax and flute. On the piano, that's Hank Himsoth. Hank. We have James Souter on the bass. James Souter. Aaron Easley is on the drums. Aaron Easley. And on guitar, Bruce Saunders. Bruce Saunders. It looks like uh, we got one up that uh, Alex brought into the band. Comes from the one of a kind drummer, Elvin Jones, who's called EJ's Blues. Thank you. 
All right. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for listening, wherever you are. It's been a pleasure. Nothing like playing monks. It's a great spot, right? Hank Hipsoth, Alex Koch, James Suter, Aaron Easley, Bruce Saunders, and I'm John Mills. Thank you. See you down the road. <laughs>